Hello friends, Sentinel H here and welcome back to Space Engineers. I I wanted to record some more Space Engineers because I enjoyed it and because we lost our progress from before because the server crashed. But now we're having all kinds of issues and this stupid camera won't go away. We're still, gonna we're still gonna try and play it. The sim speed is a bit low. Like quite low. It was perfect before. I have no idea why it's in the toilet today. And you won't listen to me when I'm selling. Tell you why? It's because all the building we're doing is a bug where you place and remove. Oh, your computer bug. crap! So no, I'm wild over quiet. I was about to say there's a bug that's going on. That's kind of random when it happens. It depends on when you world load your save and what you're doing. So basically, what happens is when you place and remove blocks. It's this. This is a bug that the Keen actually did inadvertently. But when you place some root blocks, it actually destroys your sim speed and causes lag every time you do a block. Well, even when we're not doing blocks, the sim speed is still crap. And it's, it's the server for me. sim speed, not mine. It's 70 for me when it when I'm not doing anything. But and when I can't I do, weld do this light. Why can't I weld this light? Maybe you have to use a heavy instead. Now I can't weld this little light. I welded the other light just fine. Maybe because you're not actually getting to it properly. No, I, I, it didn't work. This light over here just welded up fine. And this light, but this light right here won't weld. This is going weird. I guess it is weird. It's supposed to work. Everything should work. Because I say it should. Same here, but I don't know what's causing it all. The universe should listen to me. I don't know, I've just been really annoyed with games not working recently. Things should work. The way As a Linux to. gamer, please. You know no pain. Things should work the way that they're supposed to. Well, you chose that life, water lover. Windows forced me into a life of despair, so I switched to Linux. <laughs> a life of despair? It was either masochism or masochism, so I picked the least masochistic choice. Isn't Linux the most masochistic choice? No, Windows is worse. I spent two days yesterday trying to fix my freaking computer because of Windows. How is Windows the worst? It's the most compatible. Because OS. it doesn't tell you when something is broken. You just Actually, pretty much have to reinstall. Actually, it does. Actually, it does. It says it something spoke. happened. That's it. Something, something happened. <laughs> something that's happened. that's all you get. That's if you don't your set computer up properly. is broke. Oh, Shiva, what are you doing? Well, these two, this. Lennox will say, "Seg faulted section." Blah 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 blah. blah. Yeah, and oh, what else is that too? If you get to the right place. I have no hydrogen. That's why I can't fly. Yeah, but that place is hard to get to, and I don't know how. So uh, what place not is really. hard to get to? The Trying to get Windows logs. to tell you what's wrong. You can't get He's... to the event logs if your computer won't boot. What's true that? Won't Safe that. mode. Safe mode is the exact same thing as regular Windows, just with less for programs running. It's for viruses most. I've I've used safe mode to great effect. Several times when I couldn't get into the thing, safe mode was fantastic. When you couldn't get into the series of tubes? I couldn't get into the thing, no. With Linux, if something breaks on boot, oh, uh, if something breaks on boot, it'll stop the boot, tell you what's wrong, and you can start booting at any point. So if part A loads, you can just only load part A. If everything breaks, it'll actually load you into a text editor called Emacs before it'll shut down and crash. Mm, so, it has some pretty cool fails. <sighs> Dang, this now. lag is getting pretty bad. Now I'm getting frame log. But my rocket's almost ready. Is that a rocket in your pocket? <laughs> now I'm gonna go look for some Sylvester. Sylvester Stallone. Sylvester Stallone. I, I missed the Leonardo DiCaprio memes. Yeah, they, they really exploded after you won the Oscar. And not in a good way. What do you mean not in a good way? Oh, I can't walk through there because that's glass! Ha ha ha! Ah, fantastic. Oh, the lights are right off. Oh man, I love those videos of people uh, bumping into really clear glass windows. Yeah, I know. And like, then somebody smudges them up and it hurts. 
Shiva, where is the list of Z places where I could get Z ore? Uh, downstairs and out, outside the garage. You're pretty much right, right next to it. Down. Over here. I need silver. I need power cells. Silver. I've got the power cells. I don't think we found silver yet. No. Oh no. Time to build a ship to find silver. How come everything's red? What do you mean? According to the system, we're out of iron. We're probably... It, give it a few seconds. It, it has a delay, but we could be. Yeah, we're out of iron. Everything that takes iron has stopped running. Wait, why, why, who is creating ISM Gundel ammo? A thousand of it. <laughs> that was me. Well, that's where it's all our ammo turrets. went. That's where all our iron went. Uh, that does, that takes iron and magnesium. We didn't have much magnesium, so I don't know. What else? Yeah, but, mm. I gotta go get some iron. In well, the... your mining drone's still out there, so go after it. In the dark. I'm gonna build a little ship to go and find me some things. It's a nice recon ship. Are you gonna go find yourself some dank memes? Yes. Sounds like a wonderful... Endeavor, I, ho I wholeheartedly endorse it. You need to go find some rare Pepe's water lover. Yes, some beautiful <laughs> rare. <Pepe's. laughs> I thought that meme was dead, but you resurrected it. You're a necromancer for meme. A memeomancer. Uh, oh, we need iron. Yeah, that's what I'm out here yeah. getting. Why don't you go join him, our lover? I am going to put a ton of it in this cargo container, and then we're going to fly the cargo container back to the base. Or more like I am. Yeah. Okay, I'm disassembling a ton of stuff. Disassemble all those stupid t uh, tools that are in that crate. There's like tons of them. This thing can hold 156,000? Mm-hmm. Since when? It's ever. Huh. No, they, they recently, a while back, didn't they increase the uh, storage capacity of the uh, car, large cargo crates on uh, small ships? Yeah, recently, actually. Because the cargo con containers on the small ships were so low in capacity that it only made sense to use the large one. Mm hmm. Yeah, they were lower than the inventory of the person. The small car containers were a joke. What? The heck? What? I what? Definitely, I'm definitely. Did you forget how to English, Shiva? Forgot how no, to I English. No, I forgot to disable my um notifications on Windows and it had pop up and actually click Can you, it can you cancel all of that ammo that the, the the system is trying to make so that it doesn't burn through all of our iron as soon as we get it there? Uh, yeah, but somehow to do because I just whacked up. Like the base and kill myself. It was also producing a ton of iron too. A ton of what do you call it? Steel plates. Well, we always need those. But yeah, turn that off. We have plenty of steel plates. Yep. We need other stuff at the moment. I disassembled all the tools. Good. Where are you? I'm over at ore site three. Oh, I see. That's pretty far. In my iron hole. Doing a pretty decent job of mining, even with the low car carrying capacity. See, once we get that vehicle built, we can slowly cut through the ice until we eventually get down to uh, the ore. And then we just drive mm -hmm. it. We drive I'm it disassembling some steel plates we, to get we, dri it, we drive it around like a Zamboni. And it, it takes off layer after layer of the ice until eventually we get down to the ores in that area. And it ends up looking like a quarry. Shiva, these just have to disassemble. Don't, don't use the primary one then. I need to disassemble some of these because we need stuff. I'll, I'll put it back back Please. to assembling right now. All right, there's fifty six, there's fifty seven thousand iron ore in this Out of thing. Silver now. Hey Shiva, do you want to fly this thing back to the base? Yeah, give me a second. I'm gonna gain some stuff. 
building a ship here myself. I'm only starting to. Alright, okay. Okay, let's okay. Okay. I've got four reactors built. Okay, fight. Okay. Let's see okay. if we can take off. Huh? Are we out of motors? We're yeah. out of materials for uh, motors. See Steven, did can... you take all the motors? We were out of motors. We need, uh, I need to bring this iron back to make more. Oh, no, we have plenty of materials for motors. Oh, okay. Wait, what the heck's going on? Did the the cargo drone left. Did the game just crash? No. Oh, uh, it was a mega freeze, though. I was paw stopped in midair. What is that electronics panel info.log? It keeps happening. Storage something electronics panel. I seen app data. I need to check that apparently. What is this big grate in the oh, floor? Oh, I need uranium. Duh. That's a welder. What? Yep. It, it looks like a giant grate. It's a welder. It doesn't look like a welder. Does it weld? Yes, <laughs> if you get, if you hook up the conveyors. Oh well. I just dumped all that ingots into the system, so it should be uh, processing the iron now. Oh, great. Because I wanted to, I needed to make power cells, and we were out of the iron. I couldn't make power cells. Did my power cells get crafted? Probably. I don't see them. Let's turn Anyone off. see this? Can anyone see the cargo drone yet? I saw it while I was flying past it. Well, it's right now. It should be somewhere near the base. I need to see. Let's see lights. Let's turn them on. The blinking. I'm watching for should it. Should we? It should be like um towards the opposite direction of the ice field. What? Uh, Why is it over at, there? Because I kind of had too much speed while I was flying over. You flew past the base? Yeah. Do you I see it blinking? Should we see the... Should we see it like oh, a red light? Oh, I see it up there now. I see the, the, the beacon thing. Let me see it. I see it because of... Yeah, I see you up there. Man, you really Ooh. overshot the, <laughs> overshot the base, didn't you? Yeah, you about 700 right. meters. Well, at least this you didn't gonna crash This is going to be our maiden it, voyage. Right? Are you going to launch that thing? Yes. You know, as soon as you break it off the thing it's gonna fall over isn't it no not the rocket this little recon ship I built oh wait where oh that thing and it goes immediately into overload that's now falling on the floor it takes a lot of power to run those atmospheric thrusters yeah you're right I need more reactors but we need Silva and Shiva is being a Jew with these ships what are you talking about water lover that's racist well, technically not racist, technically anti-Seminist. Well, yeah, yeah, that's anti-Semitic. <laughs> Sorry if you're offended. It's just all in good... I'm not humor. offended, I know it's a joke. It's no, to watch people watching the video. Just be really careful about that. Some people have no sense of humor. And we call oh, those people is. SJWs. Nah, I just ignore them. Or I try to set them off even more and trigger them. See how far I can get them. Yeah. Oh, I know what's causing the issue. Trigger, safe spa something. trigger warnings in safe spaces make me so mad. I'm triggered by safe spaces. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, and I really don't want to. Safe spaces. Come on, you have to have heard Turn that about off. Turn that off. Safe spaces. Okay, well, she get a performance boost. If not, yeah, I don't know. Water lever. You mean you haven't heard about the, uh, you no. haven't heard about the, oh, I can't, oh, I can't move. Oh, there we go. You haven't heard about the college where the African-American students wanted to create, um, no white zones? That's literally what happened in the 60s. They wanted to create a uh, minority only, or they call them pox, people of color. They wanted to create people of color only zones so that they could feel safe from the white people. It, That's it, it's literally... The most, it's self-imposed segregation. Definition. And um, it really upset me. 
No, but that's literally, quote unquote, the definition of what happened in the 60s that set everyone off. Yeah, they're they're just rolling back the clock on the uh, the victories that were won by uh, by the civil rights movement. And of course, they're college kids. They they know nothing. College kids know nothing until enough knowledge is pounded into them. But safe spaces are an attempt to not have to face new knowledge. You know, people don't want to. People don't. They don't want to. They don't want to come face to face with. With. They don't want to have to experience points of view that are different to theirs, and and consider them and think about them. That's college students. Confirmation bias is existing. Shiva, this is disassembling. Confirmation bias is. I'm not doing anything of the assemblers. Dangerous. Oh, something popped in there. No, I can't find this cargo drone, and I can't tell where it's at. Wait, you mean you lost the cargo drone? No, I still see it. I just can't tell, tell it's level and everything on the grip from the ground and everything. Man, the lag is real. Yeah, I figured what it was. Somehow some of the laser antennas start leaking to something that's not there and that's what's causing it. Oh, My mom it? brought me a brownie. I doubt uh, until I reload the world, no. Oh no, I need reactor components for this nuclear reactor. We're all out of silver completely. Yeah. All right, I don't need to finish the nuclear reactor. It's, it's also got solar panels on it, but it's nighttime. <laughs> Why am I dying? You're dying. Because <laughs> you're dying. <laughs> Did you leave your helmet on? Did you run out of oxygen? You know that even when you're on the planet, your ship has to have oxygen in the cockpit, otherwise you'd die, right? Yeah, I forgot. I have to turn on the air vent. <laughs> and turn on the decompress, that's what you need to. Yeah, I know. That's what I just did. Now we have power again. You mean oxygen? <laughs> now you're not dying? Because it would be a good idea to not die. Yeah, that's what we're... That's what, uh, you know, human beings are made to do. That's what we're supposed to do. The people that are better at it, they get to pass on their genes. People who are better at eating, sleeping, and not dying. <laughs> that was, um... Zog from Beetlejuice. It's a great series of, uh... Like he, he's like an alien giving other aliens a crash course on humanity in a very tongue-in-cheek but completely scientifically accurate manner. Well, I don't know how scientific it is to say that our our uh, genetic imperative uh, is, is about squids being stupid. What? Acor according to the Zog from Beetlejuice um, canon, of, uh, there was a giant war between the squids and these other people and and they created all these bombs and the bombs what they were was they contained genetic code they would seed a world with life an actual life form whose genetic code when de when decoded in, into the uh, into the language would say would read squids are stupid and that's what we were that's what humanity was but squids squids are stupid no it, we were a bomb they sent a, a missile, and it went off course, and it struck uh, Earth, which was a planet nobody cared about because there was nothing there, and um, and created life. And now, because they couldn't account for what happened to that one bomb, they officially lost the war. Um, and then an entire race of, of beings evolved from a genetic code whose entire purpose for replicating was to spread the message that squids are stupid. Well, that's how life is. Anything that'll replicate will create those properties. And that's why genetic algorithms and stuff are dangerous. Yeah. According to Zog from Beetlejuice, most planets don't aren't allowed to... The life aren't, isn't allowed to just evolve normally by itself. Uh, when a planet is, is given the green light for uh, having life by the Galactic Council, which is run by the, uh, the brain-controlling um, wor brain worms, uh, they send a an overseer to to oversee everything and um, and guide the evolution and make sure it's complies with the law and stuff. But Earth didn't have that. Oh, stinging adversary is bad. What's bad? 
Stinging adversary. What's that? Uh, getting closer. That's what it is. What are you talking about? Something on the antenna that's a stinging adversary. Yeah. That's bad. It's moving closer? Oh, it actually it's been damaged to the point where it's no longer usable. Okay, good. What, you mean it's getting closer? It no, was getting not. closer it's just sitting, No, it's sitting still. The stinging okay. adversary for me it was. has been there forever. Is that because you were getting closer to it? Oh, uh, logic. <laughs> I recently watched, a, a, today I watched a video from Total Biscuit where he was talking about YouTube's bitrate isn't high enough for fa uh, for Far Cry Primal. What, there's just too much stuff going on? All Far Cry Primal videos, no matter how high quality you record it, will have low, will be full of artifacting because the bitrate on YouTube isn't high enough with all of the uh, crazy like grass in the game and stuff. Um, the bitrate isn't high enough to, to, to render it properly, so on YouTube, Far Cry Primal will always look like, well, crap. There's oh, there's just too much stuff going on yeah, in the game. Yeah, YouTube needs to up its bitrate. It's, we're at the bitrate cap. You can't make it better either. Like, um, if you upload a video in 1440, it, 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 it is given a higher bitrate, but Total Biscuit tried, you know, the whole upscaling thing, and it really, you can't tell the difference. Um, you really can't. So that's not a viable alternative. YouTube just needs to give uh, gaming videos a, a higher bitrate. Or just have an option, maybe. We've reached. But, it, we've reached, but they do process lots of data daily. We've so. reached peak bitrate. <laughs> I'm giving it all she's got, Captain. The games are too good looking for YouTube's bitrate. She can't handle it, Captain. I'm gonna try to land this ship. Ready to hear rest in peace. Poor water lover. We hardly knew ye. Rippin' pepperoni. Rip Coming down for a landing. Rippin' pepperonis, water lover. Oh. What was that? A bunch of things just fell off my ship. You <laughs> crashed. You crashed? You did. You hit but the ground too hard and things I didn't blew hit off. the ground. I was going three meters a second. Everything just fell off. But apparently <laughs> all I needed was one atmospheric cluster, so that's all I lost. Oh well. We have the resources. Did you hit a tree? But yeah, I just won't land it. Might be. Why well, just gonna leave Crudent. it hovering in the air forever? Yes. Oh my god, this is a steep cliff. Oh my god. This is yeah, a steep cliff. Sounds like the cliff that you went through my rover off last time. That's straight down. Are you having troubles, water lover? Whoa, this is a steep cliff. It sounds like you're having the troubles. Okay, I'm trying to bring it down remotely. Probably should have put a camera on it. Yeah. That definitely would have helped. How far is it? Uh, 417. Is it decreasing? No. Oh, slowly, it's starting to. Okay, we now it's have, going down pretty good we right now. We now have quite a lot of radio components. Antenna complete. Oh, gosh. I'm trying to land a ship with... Oh, Lord. Lord. Two hundred? Okay. Well, Let me know when it hits a hundred. Hold oh, on, I'm right up busy. Production. Okay. Now watch it. Alright. It's so... it one it's, it's moving away from us. It's going it's at two it's Yeah, I don't moving. know. Is somebody else controlling it? Nope, I think just I think his battery died. It looks like it's crashing. On. Oh no! It's falling no! out of the sky! No! <laughs> Oh no! Rippin' pepperonis, trusty old pal. Oh, it disappeared off the radar. <laughs> oh, been... I crashed into it right as it crashed. We died together. I am a winner in Valhalla. Well, on that happy note, it's time to end this episode. Rip. Well, before we end it, want to look at my ship I'm building? Where? Um, it, it's down by, look for the welder. I see Oh, it. it's over here. It's this ship here with all these, uh, ramjets? Yeah. Interesting. That's an interesting cockpit. Spectre. I still and, die when right, I crash into Shiva. Cool. So, yeah. I hope you guys... Shiva, you're very pointy. Water lover, how is your body right here? <laughs> I crashed into Shiva. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode, even though it's been a little laggy. Wait, 
I wait. I want to try something. We're getting very close to completing this thing now. Uh, hopefully, next time we record this, it won't be so laggy. The reason that we have two, uh, that we're doing another episode of Space Engineers is because I really wanted to play more Space Engineers. So you might see. In fact, tutorial <laughs> won't work. You might see quite a bit of Space Engineers this week, just because I'm really in a Space Engineers mood. Oh my mood. gosh! This but, thing uh, is nuts. Just to let you guys quickly know, those of you who are watching, just to let you know that if. Hey, guess what, guys? Hey, Shiva didn't kill me an entire episode. Okay, Water Lover, I'm actually trying to give a, an important announcement. Sorry. So, yes. I'm thank very you. sorry. Thank you. Although I appreciate your announcement and your enthusiasm. So. Um, if, if uploads at any time in the future here start becoming a little not as regular, it's because I now have a, well, you could call it a full-time, part-time job of, of watching, um, my, my, uh, my brother's girlfriend's son every day, uh, except for one, uh, Wednesdays, um, which I don't upload anyway because I'm working. But it's a good thing because that means that I have actually have the money to pay the bills now. Um, I really appreciate, uh, you guys that, uh, one of the, that are, um, my patrons on, on Patreon, you really helped me out. Um, so, but we don't have to quite worry about the channel ending now. Uh, it just might have a reduced amount of uploads uh, on a regular basis. Rip, so rip anyway, this channel. No, water lover. Anyway, rip it, stop it. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Stay tuned for Blah. more content. I'm Sentinel H, and I'm signing out.